Considering that we've been hitting these slopes for two days straight, I think I've gotten a lot better. Of course, just when I get the hang of things is the moment we have to leave. Happens every time. <sighs> what should I do? I'm going to be headhunted by the pros. I already have an exclusive contract with Juness. Dude, there are no competitions where you slide downhill on your stomach. Snow is weird. I've never seen it before. How does this stuff get in the sky in the first place? It's the same as rain, but when it's too cold, it just freezes and falls to snow. Wouldn't that make it like little lumpy ice balls that bonk you on the head and stuff? Ouch! Why are you being so nitpicky? It's kind of mysterious, though. How these little white water flowers just tumble delicately from the sky. When you look up, you usually don't notice it, but I can understand how deep the sky is. I feel like I'm falling in. Wow. I always had a feeling you were one of those warrior poet types, but I didn't see that coming. <sighs> Kanji's got the heart of a dreamy little girl. Shut the hell up. You started this stupid conversation in the first place. I just asked where snow comes from. I didn't start writing berry tales about white flowers and falling into the sky and stuff. You, you picking a fight with me, Ted? It's gonna get dark soon. It's starting to snow too, so we should be getting back. I think today's dinner had some actual meat. If we get there too late, that carnivore is gonna get it all. Considering how active we've been today, it'll really suck if we don't get some dinner tonight. So, which way do we go to get back to the lodge? I wasn't really paying attention. I wasn't expecting it to start snowing this much, and I thought we'd be able to see it from up here. How about you, Senpai? You remember the way? Dude, are you sure? This might be a ski area, but one wrong turn and we'll end up in the mountains. At least if worse comes to worse, I can just go into high bear nation. I read about that in a book. Don't even think about it. You'll wake up in the afterlife. In any case, let's get going. We can't dally around with the snow in this much. You're right. All right, then, let's go. Dude, are you sure? This might be a ski area, but one wrong turn and we'll end up in the mountains. At least if worse comes to worse, I can just go into high bear nation. I read about that in a book. Don't even think about it. You'll wake up in the afterlife. In any case, let's get going. We can't dally around with the snow in this much. You're right. All right then, let's go. Are you guys okay? You guys are all still here, right? You two, me, and... Hey, where, where's Teddy? I'm here! And no jokes like, eh, that snowman's talking right now, please! This isn't good! We're com completely lost! And it's so cold that I'm gonna die! Don't give up so easy! Show some guts, damn it! I remember reading that the people who give up first are the ones who end up dying. Actually, Sensei, I think my batteries are about to wear out. He just said not to fall asleep! Quit screwing around! You'll die! F -f -f for real! Hey, doesn't that look like a cottage? Great, and now he's hallucinating. You start dreaming on your feet, and pretty soon you're dead. 
I'm not dreaming, asshole. Open your freaking eyes and look! Woo! That is indeed a snowy mountain cottage! When night falls, the phone line gets cut, and one by one the inhabitants die by the fireplace poker. That'll be the least of our worries. Look, we can't stay out in the snow like this. Let's get over there, qu quick! Such overconfidence was the fall of many a mountain man. Quit saying shit like that! It'll bring, bring bad luck! Hey, doesn't that look like a cottage? Great, and now he's hallucinating. You start dreaming on your feet and pretty... Snow, hot, 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 hike. It, it's no use. He's done for in many ways. Hey, doesn't that look like a cottage? Great, and now he's hallucinating. You start dreaming on your feet and pretty soon you're dead. I'm not... I can't see anything. Wonder why it was open. I don't know, but it's better than freezing to death. Let's just consider ourselves lucky, okay? Anybody know the lodge's phone number? We can call them up and have them send some rescue services or something. Seriously? Don't tell me. No one knows what it is? I don't have my phone with me. Me neither. Really? Come on, man! That's why cell phones were invented! You're supposed to keep it around! Who the hell would I call? We're all hanging around together! If you told me we were gonna get lost, I'd have remembered to BRING IT! I'm all naked in here! You should have told me that this was gonna happen! How was I supposed to know? If I'd known this was gonna happen, then we wouldn't have gotten lost! Fine, I'll give Chie a call. Come on, Yosuke, quit stalling! Hurry up and call Chie-chan! The battery's dead. After all the shit you gave us for being unprepared, now this! It's an old phone, so it runs out fast. I can't afford a new one because I was saving up for a motorcycle. I never would have imagined something like this would happen. Come on, partner, you're our only hope. Senpai! You're our hero, right? You always save us, Sensei. I've always believed in you. Well, that's it then. It's hopeless. I'm so freezing. Even under that suit? We don't know when this blizzard's going to stop either. We're screwed if we have to spend the night here. Oh well, there's a hearth over there. Let's start a fire in that. But how are we going to do that? I don't have a lighter or anything. Let's look around. If there's a hearth here. There's got to be stuff to use in it. Man, it looks like we're gonna survive this. Look where we are. Even if we do get in touch with the others, are they gonna be able to find us? I bet we'll freeze here. Come tomorrow morning, we'll just be lumps of ice. Sensei, your courage is awe-inspiring. I feel a little warmer just basking in the glow of your awesomeness. But man, this little fire is too small to warm up the four of us. Let's light a fire on part of the floor then. This whole place is made of wood. That's called arson! We'll end up all burning to death instead of freezing to death! 
Jeez, all you do is complain. I don't see you offering any ideas. Well, if we can't start a fire, all we can do is wear more stuff. Is there a sleeping bag or something around here? Oh, yeah. Like a big, thick, fuzzy bag is gonna be just sitting here. Wh what? Maybe it might fit four. But I'm like a newborn baby here. If the three of you come in, my innocence will be destroyed. Will you not get off with that crap? That thing turned on just now, right? It wasn't just me. Right. But why? I'm coming too, senpai. Me three. This smells really fishy. Hey, wait up! Whoa, dude, stop it! What the hell are you doing? Quit fooling around! But we have to find out, right, senpai? No! S sensei stop it! You'll fall in! Hey! Wh what do you guys think you're doing? Senpai, no! Don't leave me! Still dressed. What are you doing here? Wait, what about our clothes? Why wouldn't they be dressed? Ugh, do I really have to spell it out? Did you girls come to rescue us? I can't believe you came so far into the mountains after me. What are you talking about? This little hut is right behind the lodge we're staying in. It seems it's a storage shed. They don't lock it because workers come here often during the day. Anyway, what were the four of you doing shoving each other around in here? Uh, we were checking the TV. Why? What's the matter with it? Oh, uh, is this one of those male bonding things or something? Do you want us to come back later? Give you some time? What? No! No! You're completely misunderstanding! Really? Shut up! We're gonna make it happen! But man, this little fire's too small to warm up the four of us. Let's light a fire on part of the floor then. This whole place is made of wood. That's called arson! We'll end up all burning to death instead of freezing to death. Jeez, all you... Uh, right. But why... I'm coming too, senpai. Me three? This smells really fishy. Hey, wait up! No! Sensei's losing it! But man, this little fire's too small to warm up the four of us. Let's light a fire on part of the floor, then. This whole place is made of wood. That's called arson! We'll end up all burning to death instead of freezing to death! Jeez, all you do is complain. I don't see you offering any ideas. Well, if we can't start a fire, all we can do is wear more stuff. Is there a sleeping bag or something around here? Oh, yeah! Like a big, thick, fuzzy bag is gonna be just sitting here. What? Maybe. Okay, so you got lost, stumbled onto this convenient cottage, and needed to warm each other up. No, damn it! Why aren't you listening? The TV just turned itself on. It makes no sense. The case has been over for months. So? Maybe the wiring's bad or something, or you saw some light reflected in it. This misunderstanding is unbearable. I feel so unclean. My reputation has been sullied. From the looks of it, this TV isn't even plugged in. If what you are all saying is true, then we may want to investigate this. That's what we've been saying from the start. This TV, huh? Then let's take a closer look, shall we? Uh, hey, wait a sec. 